so um, this video, I'm going to um, upgrade a few things on this uh, new Asus Zephyrus that I got. So I've seen a lot of videos online. People keep opening this thing up and show you what um, you can get inside or how it looks like inside. But they don't show you how to actually open it and tear it apart pretty much. Um, it's pretty difficult if you haven't done it for the first time because you have to figure out a few things in there. So I'm just going to upgrade a um, couple of things. Um, so I'm going to upgrade my RAM to this crucial 16 gig. So that will expand it to uh, all the way max, which is 24 gigs of RAM. And I'm also replacing the um, uh, my um, SSD to this one terabyte 960 EVO M2. I mean, it's pretty fast. And for the storage, this was one of the best values I could find. So there are two different steps to this. We have to unscrew these two parts for, I mean, um, there are four, total of four screws here. One, two, and there are two on this side. Once we lift or peel this part of it off, then there are a bunch of other screws, like I believe there are T5s that we have to unscrew all around, and there's some down there as well, which I will show you guys. All right, uh, let me put the camera back here, and I'm gonna start tearing it apart. Sort of. We'll see how that goes. All right. You may want to keep the um, screws so we don't lose them. I have lost them before. So now here, because of the uh, the mechanism that um, this has, because of the bottom, and it's, um, when you open the lid, it sort of um, opens up. We have to actually do that in order to take this back off. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to lift it up, open it halfway, and then once it's open halfway like this, all you got to do is just basically um, push it up a little bit and then the back easily comes off okay All right. so we got the fans and um, I can show you guys a little bit better so basically what I'm going to do now is I'm going to unscrew all these T5s I mean there are quite a bit of them here we got them here in the middle. We got them on top right there. So just bear with me. I'm going to get them unscrewed. All right. You can fast forward these steps if you like. One thing I gotta say though, um, this laptop looks much, much nicer and cooler in person than actually just looking at the videos. I mean, people were saying, oh yeah, it looks good, it looks good, but until you actually play with it and actually feel it in your hand, it's, it's pretty solid machine. So I'm hoping the performance is as good as they say it is. Well, I mean, obviously with max Q, you're not gonna get the full, um, however, in a 1080 card, but it should be a little bit like 
15 to 20 percent better than um, 1070 which is which is I would say it's pretty good I mean if you just look what you're getting I mean the size of this laptop and the way it looks I think it's worth the money okay I think I'm done one more screw here okay I think I got them all all right so the way I found the easiest way to now this is the tricky part it took me a while to figure out how to take this because basically you have to take this off off pretty much from the other side and everything is inside so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn this around I'm gonna open the lid and now from the sides right here can put your nails or whatever and then try to open it up and push it up I guess it will help if I try to open the sides a little bit maybe not you gotta keep play with this so but what you gotta do is get right here I can feel it that I'm opening the hinges. All right, I think I got it. There we go. All right. And be very careful up here just because all these um, the cables are connected here, especially this one, the white one. The first time I did it, I peel it off. Okay, let me bring this closer. okay so this is the um the storage and here is the ram um this part of it obviously is hopefully is easy for you guys let me tr switch my screwdriver okay i'm gonna switch the ram slots first pretty easy to take off yeah I'm sorry I should have taken these off first before I started this okay so oops all right All right, that goes there. And then to switch my drive. Let's see. Hmm, they put a sticker up here. This is new. Oh, well, I'm going to try to poke it in. All right. Okay. They use a some sort of ends of glue here, I think. Yeah, all right. You gotta put a little bit of pressure to lift it up, but just don't go too hard because you might break the actual SSD. All right, let me take my SSD card out. So here's my 960 right here. I'm just gonna stick it in there. This is the simplest part. All right. Well, simple as that, so we are pretty much done. So I'll to just show you guys inside, I guess, if you want to see. 
close up. 